Hey guys, Cyber Dragon here. So, today is Friday, October 29th, 2021. Today is the My Hero Academia movie, and I am going to go see it. Oh boy, I'm excited for today. But other than that, I'm also going to record What If Deku Was the Son of Rapa, part 5. And something we didn't notice in the Discord that Rapa's name is Kendo. And the ship is Kendo. I swear to God, that was coincidence. We hope it they're not related in any sort of way, but still. <laughs> so, cause I don't want to think about that. <laughs> But yes, I will be recording this, and one other note, I noticed all of you have chosen Agnologia as the what if you are wanting. So, I will be working to make a thumbnail for that. We already got a what if for it, so without further ado, let's start. It is the next day at UA, and Kendo is just standing there with a blank face, still processing the fact that Momo told her that Deku likes her back. Kendo, 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 Kendo. Huh? Oh, uh, I Izuku. Hi Kendo, why is your face red? Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I I'm fine. He likes me, he likes me. Are you sure? Deku gets to face to face level. Uh, yeah. S -s so close. And is blushing massively. So think of it like how Amory was blushing massively when Iruma got that close to her, basically. <laughs> if you get from uh, Welcome to Demon School Iruma. Okay, Kendo, but you're really red. Put he puts his giant hand on Kendo's forehead. Hmm, and warm. Kendo, a new shade of red and steaming. Wow, you're really warm. As Deku hugs him, you're like one of those heat up blankets when you get on cold night. Eh. Why are you doing this, Izuku? Holding Kendo like a teddy bear now. Deku is holding Kendo like a teddy bear now. Aw, you two look so cute together. Well, Kendo, yes, is cute, but I've been told I'm not that cute because I punch stuff so much. D did he say I was cute? Wait, did you say she was cute, Midoriya? Yeah, Kendo's cute. What? So, did you hear... Didn't you hear me before? Kendo... E-X-E... Sir, blue screen. Hmm? Kendo! As Deku lifts her up to eye level... Kendo, who's broken? Kendo? Kendo! Kendo! As Deku's shaking Kendo violently. Ah! My punching body is broken! Kendo! Ah! As Kendo punches Deku on the head. And Deku drops Kendo, stepping back. Uh, I'm sorry, Izuku. Ah, you made my nose bleed. <laughs> nice to see you're still working, my... But my turn! No! Enough! Uh, did you activate with your glowing eyes? Just sit down, Midoriya. Fine. As Deku sits down. Uh, on the floor. Good enough. Now, today we will be voting for a class representative and vice rep. 
Oh, okay, easy. It says, Kendo and Ponytail Girl. Wait, why Kendo for president, not me? She's my punching buddy, and she's smart, and he starts to list off a bunch of different reasons. What's great about Kendo? And Kendo blushes at every comment, even a deeper shade of red. Oh, and she's pretty. That's why I vote for Kendo. Why does he list all of this stuff in front of everyone? And you are smart, like. Smart, but I still vote for Kendo. Hmm. Well, fine. I'll probably get the others vote, anyways. Oh, and she's the only other person who can make me bleed. Everyone's just face palms. What? <sighs> Nothing. So they do their votes, and yep, Kendo actually does get the vice, the representative spot, while Mo, Mo gets the vice rep. Yay, Kendo won! So, what do your representatives do? Uh, well, I lead the class for the most part. Like Mom one leads at home, I guess. <laughs> and Ducky drops Kendo and run. To the other side of the classroom. Everyone is wondering the fuck is going on. Is it good? Get back here. You'll be fine. You said you'll be like Mom One. <laughs> but I'll lead my way. I'm not gonna be exactly like her. Hey, fun Kendo! Unless you get in trouble. No, boring Kendo. Izuku! <gasps> Enough! Okay, go to lunch, all of you. Wait, food? Yes, food. Now go, you raging Hulk monster of a man child. Hey, food! As Deku picks up Kendo, Mina, Kirishima, and Tetsu Tetsu and throw them all on his shoulders. Everyone's just standing there like, the fuck is happening? And uh, I think it's just going so through the p so through the crowds of people knocking them all out of the way. Uh, I need a raise. Oh hey it hey look it's class one A the worst class of out of the way little yellow dude. <laughs> It was Monoma, if you're wondering. Deku kicks him out of the way and continues to run t stampeding through the cafeteria. And as he pushes everyone that was in line out of the way, food now! Uh, sure. As Lunch Rush hands him some food, yes! And put Keep the four down and grab a whole bowl of food and eat it in one bite. Food. Uh, okay. He hands them some bowls. And he keeps eating it all basically in one bite somehow. This goes on for a while. To food. No! No more food! Get out of here! As well, Kendo and everyone else already got their food, but Deku just stared in front of Lunch Rush the entire time, just demanding more food. As Deku goes to sit with the, his group. Did you eat? Did you get everything you want to eat, Izuku? Yes, I did. Good. As Deku just falls down sleeping. Man, he's like a grizzly bear whenever he eats that much. I think he's kind of cute when he does this. Everyone just looks at Kendo. What? Just ask him out already! Uh, what? Kendo, it's not a secret that you... 
you know you like him. And he's in his, his dumb way, he likes you too. Yep, me and Kirishima has been friends for a really long time and he's never treated me like how he treats you. So you're a very special case. No, that's... Alert, alert. So, villains have infiltrated the vicinity. Huh? What kind of dumbass alarm is that? Oh no. As everyone looks at Deku, FIGHT! He immediately punched Tetsu Tetsu and he went flying. Ow, oh, why? FIGHT! Haha, <laughs> look at the. T Deku punches Monoma. Oh! Ew, he vomited. Kendo, you need to stop him! It's. Mina's hiding behind the table. How? Uh, I don't know, try something. Uh, like from the movies, How to Train a Dragon. Do the hand thing. He's not a dragon, you know. As Mina points out, Deku, are you sure about that? Deku, um, Kendall looks back, see Deku drinking some gasoline and grabbing a lighter, somehow being, making it look like he's being fire. Fair enough. Gets up and slowly approaches Deku. As Deku smashes the table in half. Uh, hey, Izuku. Calm down. Wait, what am I doing? This is not... This is a stupid trick. This won't ever work. Hmm? Hey. As kind of the, the hand thing hiccup does. Fight? No! As Deku throws a punch, Kendo dodges. Well, I knew that didn't work. Out. Think, think. Oh no. I'm gonna have to do it, aren't I? Fight! As Deku just breaks and bust of shit. Okay, here goes. As Kendo rushes at Deku, jumps on him, and kisses him to calm him down. Mina is. Finally! Yes! As Deku completely stops in mid action, processing what the hell's going on. I can't believe I'm doing this. I can't believe I'm doing this! And Kendo is still kissing, kissing him. Why is Kendo kissing me? After a moment, she breaks a kiss. And Deku just stands there. No reaction. Wow, was uh, was Hiccup kissing Toothless part of the Blu-ray special edition? Mina shut it! So that stupid plan didn't even work. As Kendo is blushing. As Deku hugs her and sits down. Kendo blushing more. Kendo, why did you kiss me? Um uh, um I uh she enlarges her fist and punches him in the face. Ow. Oh. Kendo, you chicken! As Kiyoshima is pulling Tetsu Tetsu out of the wall. Ah, oh, my face! God, do you feel like a fourth or fifth wheel? I feel like a sixth. Damn. Well, let's see if Izukubo fully calmed down. That was nice. Oh, was it? Yeah, the How to Train a Mo Dragon movie was nice. Ah, no! What about when Kendo kisses you? What kiss? Uh, you literally asked Kendo, why did you k kiss me? I don't remember that. As Deku scratches his head, there's a huge ass bump on his head. I'm done. Tamina walks away. Why does my head hurt? Did she punch you that hard? Who punched me? 
Wait here, I'll get recovery, girl. So, Deku... Sir... Gets checked over by recovery, girl, and... Well, you will hear what happened. So, what's up with him? So, nothing. He just has a concussion. He will gain his... He will... He will gain his memory soon. I'm sorry, Zuku. Sorry for what? For punching you. Oh, right! That was before you kissed me! Kendo blushes massively. I'm gonna let you two figure this out. And recovery girl leaves. While I'm hungry, let's go... If you... The cook is still up or not. And Seki walks out. The fuck just happened? I don't know, Mina. So later, during the day, everyone's in class. Now, then, if we will vote for the rest of the representatives. But before that, someone knocked on the door. Come in. As Miracle walks in. Miracle? Mom too? Yep. Now. It's Zuku. Why the fuck? Why did you. So why did me and Iku get a damage and destruction bill? I'm sorry. Why the fuck did you destroy the cafeteria? Thanks, Walnut. Wait, I can't stay man. Um, I did something similar one time. Well, I was sitting next to ten Kendo, then I heard an alarm. And then I was just thinking that it was a fight, then I started to punch things, then next thing I know, Kendo's doing this weird hand thing with, from Heck of How to Train a Dragon, then after that, she jumps on me, then kissed me. And then she punched me and ran away. And now we're here. <laughs> Miracle grins ear to ear. While Kendo's blushing massively. <laughs> well. So, Azara. I'm going to be your assistant teacher from now on. Mostly due to the fact that we need someone to keep him in track. And I don't think he wants Inko here. Good. His girlfriend is a softie with him, anyways. So, yep. Kendo is a new shade of red. So, now that I'm your new assistant teacher, what to do first? Well, tomorrow is the USJ. <gasps> the Universal of Japan? And thank you, Karen. Kirishima and Miyako are having excited looks. No, you three. The unforeseen simulation joint. Oh, that shithole. God, that place is boring. Can I have the day off then? God, you're just like your mother. No, you can't. Now, Miyako, you're here to control your son, not encourage him. Okay, calm down. Jeez. So the day continues as normal. Now this is where I would have ended it, but we actually got the USJ to do, so I'm gonna time skip to the USJ. The next day, everyone is already outside. Kendo, Kendo, Kendo. Uh, yeah, Izuku? I'm bored. Can we do something? Else, like, uh, fighting? No, Izuki, we, we can't fight. Why, though? Because we're going to the USJ. Mina! Huh? My kendo is broken. She's saying weird words right now. But my kendo? As kendo is a new shade of red, and Tetsu Tetsu and Kirishima are laughing their ass off. So, 
She's your kendo, huh? Well, I can't get another kendo. Momo stop. Does he have no sense of shame of what he's saying? That or doesn't he not understand the shame at all? Unless it's a kendo factory. Of course not, you boot. Do you not know where babies come from? Well, I know they... I never keep being told. Uh, they explain to me later. Well... So, nope! No time for that, folks. Okay, Mom, too. As Deku runs towards butts, but to learn he can't fit. Ugh, come on, we have to push him in. As Tetsu, Tetsu, and Kirishima try to push him in. Come on! So suck it in, is it, bro? Ugh, tiny boss! About to punch his way through. Nope! So, you, you know you don't. As Azara uses his quirk and uses a scarf to grab him out of the bus. Or the entry way of it. Hey, let me go! As Tech is trying to get out of Azara's pull away pull. You are not punching the bus. For one, they take it out of my salary. As they notice Deku's being held tight by Azara's scar. Hmm. A few moments later, the bus is going with Deku on the roof tied with Azara's scarf. Whee! This seems a bit cool. Oh, Inko will kill me if she finds out about this. Well, at least he's having fun. Right, Kendo? As Kendo, I mean, is giving a smirky grin to Kendo. Kendo blushing and... Ch shut up, or I'll put you in Izuku's sock basket. <gasps> you weren't there! I would. So... Wow! So, hey, that cow looks like Kendo. That one looked like a... a baby? Mina looks outside. Oh my... Sir. See, he's even seeing you in clouds. You, he must like you. And obviously, you like him. Kendo blushes. Shut up! As she looks out the window. Huh? At least one looks like me. Okay, okay, enough about Kendo having a crutch on Izuku. So, even you, Miracle. So, yes, even me. Let's talk about something else. Hmm. What about we talk about quirks? Uh. So, okay, you see you. So, what is a... What is Midoriya's quirk exactly? Ribbit. Oh, well, it's called Strong Body. <gasps> hey, mean uh, Kendo, you hear that? Strong Body. Eh? As Kendo is blushing. Ch shut it. It's basically giving full rotation of his arms and legs. That's... To make him really fast and hit like a truck. You're telling me. I think I lost several teeth to that dude. Plus add in the muscles he have and make it a deadly combo. <laughs> so. Yep, that is a deadly combo, right? You're saying it, Tin Man. God damn it, even you know, Miyako? I am not Tin! I'm Iron! Uh-huh, whatever you say. 
Hey, I'm hungry up here. You can eat at the USJ. Nah, I got a sandwich in my pocket up here. Everyone, what the fuck? Let me just... Ah! As you hear crashing sounds behind them. What was that? Kendo looks back. Oh my gosh, it's Yuku! Oh my god, I'm dead! Let's get him. Wow. Nice first priority, Miracle. You know the wrath of Inko. Uh, okay, okay, I'm sorry. As they stop and got Deku. Ouch. Are you okay? Yep, I just landed on my head. What a loss of a sandwich. It's just a thin piece of bread now. I'll make you one later, Izuku. Huh? Hey, someone from 1B said that's all girls are good for. Is that true? Next time you see that guy who said that, punch him. Hard. And no, that's not true, Izuku, at all. Okay, then. I say, we're not doing that again. You have a better idea? Honestly, me and Izuku could have just ran to the USJ before you got there. Izuku, time to stretch your legs. Okay, then. It's Deku starts to stretch. And how come you didn't mention this the first place? Because I didn't think your binding cloth would break. It didn't. Some one didn't tie it tight enough. Oh, so this is my fault? Isn't it? Oh, I'm gonna kick your... I got Inko on speed dial. He wouldn't dare. Wouldn't die. As Azara gives his... Usual Azara grin. Good, you evil bastard! <laughs> Call it what you want. But you should go after your son. Huh? As she looks back, she sees Deku is nothing but a dust cloud at this point. Shit! As Inko, I'm uh, not Inko, but Miyoko jumps after him. They're not even going the right way. Uh, I have so many questions. We all do, Maraka. Everyone back on the bus. They all do, and... Well, it takes Miyako and Deku to get back to the right direction for a long time. So most of the USJ has already been done. So when they finally do arrive... Ha! We made it! Where's everyone? Most likely inside, Izuku. We're extremely late. Okay. Huh? So... Are you sure this is the USJ? Yeah, I'm sure. Why? Because the door is locked. So, I have the keys. And if you're wondering why it's a door lock, plot, that's all it is. It'd be closed and someone locked it. I don't know why. It shouldn't be. Hold on, I gotta... As Deku punched the door, clean off. Keys. Hey, guys! As they see Kuragiri in 1A. Oh, who's the new guy? What? I've already been told all the students were here. Izuku, he's a villain! You can fight him! Now that's an immediate response that Deku heard in his head. Deku readies his minigun attack. Oh my god, hit the deck! As Deku starts to fire a massive amount of air bullets. Kaboom! Kaboom! Deku, uh, uh, tries to warp them all back at Deku. And some do hit him. <laughs> I am bulletproof! 
Aim at the metal spot. What's aim? <laughs> so, as by luck, Deku did hit the weak spot and send Kirigiri flying to, to Chikaraki. What the? Oh. <laughs> cry, little babies, cry. <laughs> and Zeki was firing at the villains himself. What the? Is he making a Team Fortress 2 reference? Kirigiri, what happened? Uh, you got me when apparently to be air bullets when I try to hit him with them. And he's at the old iron bullet roof. Uh, what the? But did you succeed in spreading out the students? Not really, no. Some of them I did, but not all. If you went down the only way out, I would have killed you. So. As they see Aizawa was struggling, Mirko jumps down. What the fu- Where did she come from? Why is thickness here? Uh, wait, why did you call Mirko that? It's the end of that. Everyone calls her that. Uh, no, no, no. As Chikaraki is scratching his neck violently, this isn't the plan. Get bring the Nomu. Uh, I, for once, I agree with this. I won't lead to kill that brat. Sir. Nomu. Sir. Kill the eraser head in Mirko. And that brat. Then all might. Kurgir brings in Nomu. You know what, Nomu? Kill the brat first. As the Nomu screech and runs toward Deku to punch him. Deku punch two for their fists to collide. Whoa, you're strong. As Nomu let out a shriek and punch him again. Deku throws another punch. Wait. Can you not speak or understand me? As no move shrieks, stomps on the ground, breaking the ground beneath them and making it very unstable. To make Deku lose his footing, and no move throws another punch. Deku throws a sloppy ass punch. Well, okay, I thought I'd never say this, but I think I found someone dumber than me. As Deku, as the no move grabs Deku's sloppy punch. And throws him over his sh over his shoulders, slamming him onto the ground. Ah, okay, I know how Tin Man feels now. No move about to stomp on Deku, but Deku rolls out of the way. No move reaches a shriek, and Deku got quickly got up and ready is the minigun air cannon technique, or air bullets technique, not gun mm, cannon. How many people? Many people think they can uh, beat me in smarts. Maybe, maybe. But I have yet met someone who is smart outsmarts bullets. As Deku releases many as air bullets. As it stops Nomu for the moment, and Nomu is blocking them. Bunch of Nomu flesh is being ripped off and regenerated. And Deku noticed this. Better put more into this! As Deku goes even faster, ripping even more, and it's still regenerating. As Nomu is slowly reaching Deku. Crap! Stops air bullet and starts to punch really fast because he's now right in front of him. Nomu tanks the hits and the and punches Deku in the chest, sending him back. Feet firmly into the ground. Okay, I can't believe I'm doing this. 
Teacher, I need help. Hold on. Th we're coming. As they're fighting. So Nomu rushes at Deku and punch him in the face. Ow. Okay. I just got to hold him off with far range attacks then. As Deku does the mini gun technique. Constantly. Good. Nomu, hurry up and kill the brat. Nomu slowly gets towards Deku and after two minutes of getting shot at, he grabs Deku by the face and slams his face into the ground. No, no, Deku goes to leg sweep Nomu, but just for him to hit the shock absorption, and he gets hit again in the face. He slams his face again, like as ever, and does it again and again. Ow! As more and more blood starts to seep out of his face, One A is watching this all unfold. Has seen Deku's losing a lot of blood now. As Nomu breaks one of his arms too. Ah, fuck! Okay, that's it! As Deku grabs Nomu's wrist and breaks it. As Nomu lets out a shriek. And he gets out of the Nomu's graphics and runs to a safer area. As Deku looks at his arm. Okay! Nothing to be worried about. Not like Mon 2 didn't do worse once or twice before. As Nomu lets out another shriek, his fist fixes itself. Okay. Time to go fast. As Nomu runches at Deku, but Deku is just to run away to find a way to win. If you want a reference of how he runs, just think of Sonic the Hedgehog when he runs. As Deku's just running all the trying to outrun Nomu, eventually for a miracle to run in, kicking Nomu in the head. Stopping Nomu temporarily to shrieks in pain. Huh? Mom too? Yes. You, you good? You're bleeding a lot. Nah, you did worse than me before. How many fingers am I holding up? He's holding up two currently. Uh, four? Jesus. Okay, my vision is a bit blurry at the moment, but I can still fight. No, you should. As Nomu comes and punches Deku in the ribs, breaking a few. Lifting him up in the air as he does. Hey, <coughs> Deku! As Deku smiles. <laughs> Got it! As Deku punched Nomu so hard in the brain, making the brain splat splatters out. A point blank says air pressure punch. Falls, and then the Nomu falls over lifeless. As Deku falls to his knees, struggling to stand up. Okay, okay, stand down. You don't need to move, okay? No. Look. As he points at Chicken Rock and Kurgay. They're ready and gonna attack. And I can still. I still got one good arm. Barely. No, I'll deal with them. You stay down. As Mirko jumps at Kurgay and Chicken Rock. No, I don't have to move, but I can still cover you, your back from with range. As Deku doesn't throw as fast punches, he just throws enough to make wind pressure. And the only reason why he's still up is because of all the adrenaline. As they continue to fight. The everyone is starting to get beaten. All the villains. The only two left is Kurgiri and Shikaraki. Screw this! 
as Shikaraki and Kurgi warps out. Ugh! We... As Deku falls over unconscious. Then All Might arrives, as soon as he did. Not much after that, Deku wakes up in Recovery Girl's office. Ugh. Ow, it all hurts. Two times in only one week. One week when school started, you are already a regular. Is that a good thing? Then you also send people here. No, it's not a good thing. Oh. See, it's Kendo sleeping. Oh, look, it's Kendo. She hasn't left your side this entire time. How long was I asleep? Mm, two... Looks at her watch. Nope, three days. Huh, haven't beat my record yet. How long is your record? A week! Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to another room for now. Okay. As Deku thought. Hmm. Kinda looks uncomfortable. Maybe she can be in the bed with me? Ha! <laughs> I'm a genius! As Deku picks Kendo up from her chair and lays her on his chest. As he lays back down. So, as Deku falls asleep, Kendo wakes up eventually, after some time. Hmm. Hmm? What is this? So, feels so firm and nice. As she is starting to wake up, she sees he's laying on Deku. Kendo EXE error. Hmm, Kendo. As Deku said that in his sleep, as he has one of his hands on her ass. Uh, Izuku. Mm, oh, hey, Kendo. Mm. Um, why am I on you? And why does you you have an hand on my ass? Uh. Oh. Um. Hey, Kendo. What is what is so what is in my hand? And why does it feel so firm? Wait a second. Uh, he's squeezed. <laughs> I know that feeling, it's your ass! Uh, yes, but what is it on my hand? Or why is it your hand on my it? Uh, oh well, I was just sleeping over here then... Well, and I don't know why my hand is on your hand, and on your ass. I just woke up like that too. Oh, and Little Fighter seems to like it. Flashback to the Heroes vs. Villains when he when he said what his little fighter was. Kendo is a new shade of blood, red and just broke after that. Then the door opens. I swear you me sees the position Deku and Kendo are at. Oh well hello you two. Did we interrupt something? I don't know, I don't think so. Then why is your hand on Kendo's ass? I don't know, we just woke up like this, but my little fighter seems to like it. Yo, what? So, show Kendo respect, Izuku. I didn't raise an animal. As Inko starts to hit Deku over the head constantly. Ow, ow, ow! Now, picks Kendo up off of Deku. You, mister, had to learn with to respect women. Am I understood? What? But I didn't try to do anything! Hmm. You're right. It's... Sir, you're too stupid to think of that type of stuff. Hmm. Okay. As... Sir. But no hand on her ass, okay? Okay. Um... Oh! Uh, hey Kendo, dear. How are you? I'm g good. 
probably better than good from what I can tell. In co um, Kendo broke again. Well, since you are healed, you have two weeks off of school, Izuku. Alright, time off of school. You hear that, Kendo? No school. Y yeah. Well, I think it's time for me to go home. As he picks up Kendo, puts him over his shoulder. Let's go. So, I let's go home. I got my Kendo. Oh, is your Kendo? My baby boy's growing up. Yeah, there's only one Kendo. This is a Kendo factory. But then I would have a bunch of Kendos and punching buddies. As they both just facepalm. But there's only one Kendo and she is mine. My punching buddy, not yours. So they went home and that is where I'm going to end it, guys. God, this was a long part. But yeah, soon enough I will do Jason and Acnologia. That's the what if everyone been voting for. Uh, I'm actually excited for Acnologia. We've come up with a pretty good story. I've seen some of the other Acnologia what ifs. I just don't see a lot of them that great, in my opinion. We also got some villain what ifs coming up, like Parasite, for example. Uh, and some other ones we got planned here sooner or later. I hope you guys will look forward to that. Cyber Dragon out. Peace.